What up boys and welcome back to yet another video. So I've done a couple of these videos where uh, when I live stream on Twitch TV, I get all of my viewers to run the same dungeon. So instead of getting like the results of me doing Old Man a hundred times over 10 hours, I invite like 60 people, 70, 100 people, depending on how many people want to join in. And we all have to run the same dungeon. And we have typically done dungeons where there are super items, like uh, we did Shadow and Keeper, and we also did Old Demand to see if we get some of those big ticket items that will be worth uh, making a video about. Uh, because you get obviously a lot more data. If you have 70 people doing Old Demand, 10 runs an hour, you will see the, the results from running Old Demand 700 times, right? And this time uh, we did Nomer. And the reason why we did no more is because you can get super, super rare items. Like you guys can see the, the loot table that's specific to no more uh, right here. And uh, you can get uh, a bunch of weapons that's unique to uh, to no more. Like all of these, the Mega Chopper, Super Gun, Power Hammer, Supercharger, Backblacks, Vibro Blade. Uh, but this one, the Hotshot Pilot Gloves and the cavern deep trudgers are considered super items like i've been making videos and live streaming for almost uh like eight nine years now and i've only seen them a handful of times like a couple of times each right and then you have the mech builder overalls which is like if you're familiar with loot table and old demand it's like a gin suit they're worth like half a million gold depending on your realm so i'm going to show you guys like a small clip from uh from the stream when we did it so you guys can take a look at and see what the results are. Now, there is a lot of decent schematics, patterns, and plans, and recipes that can drop inside of um, inside of uh, Nomer. You see the first item, get a, so a couple of Mega Choppers, and then you get the Mech Builder overalls dropping as well. Like, those are really good. That value is uh, someone playing on NA, because if you guys want to join this, uh, you want to join me and do all of these farms. It doesn't matter if you play EU, NA, it doesn't matter if you Horde, Alliance. I do uh, force all my viewers to do the same dungeon every single Saturday, right? And we did get a bunch of Mega Choppers because they were like the highest valued blue besides from the Vibro Blade that someone just picked up right now. Uh, but there's like probably 50 blue items that you can't see on the screen right now because they're not in on the uh, the top five most valuable items and it doesn't actually take us that long until we do see one of the super items dropping uh, in the nomer and luckily this time it was on the eu uh and um it was a, a long time viewer of mine or a stadium who actually picked up one of the, the really rare items that you can get from the dungeon. There we go. The Hotshot Pilot Gloves. Now, these are... The value of these is hard to say. It's a super item. They do share appearance with some other items. Uh, they used to be best in slot twink items, but they tend to sell. How much you will be able to sell them for is really hard to say. Like... The market value is 9.5 million gold. Now, that is not a very, very realistic price. It really isn't. The highest I've seen them sell for was a viewer of mine selling them for 2.1 million gold, which even at 2.1 million gold, that sounds absolutely insane because, as I said, they do share appearance with other items that are way easier to get. So it makes sense that they were really valuable back in the days when they were best in slot for Twinks. Uh, but now, not so much, right? Unless you have a collector who has no clue what he's doing, right? He's not using ATT or something like that. Um, now, that was actually, though, like, sadly, that was the only item. Uh, well, not the only item. It's not sad because, like, you guys got to keep in mind, these items are extremely hard to get. But if we fast forward to, like, four minutes left, you can see that not much has changed. We got a schematic for uh, the, the flash bomb. And there's a bunch of these schematics that can drop inside of this uh, inside of this dungeon. But that was the only super item that we got out of Nomer. But like, if you want to play the statistics, and you have, I think we had like 70 people doing Nomer, you're not supposed. If we did this 10 times with 70 people in, I can guarantee you we would not average a super item uh, each hour. There's no shots. Right? So if you guys got any suggestions on what I should do next, it can also be an open world farm where we just force all my viewers to go and do the same thing. 
to see if we can get something really cool leave it down below in the comment section and a big thank you to every single one of you guys that has picked up a copy of the zero to 10 million gold guide really do appreciate the support uh, it's been absolutely insane and i'm so glad that you guys are liking the frequent updates uh that's getting done to the book and of course, as always, a special thank you to the people that has uh, done the additional support by joining in on the VIP Discord. If you guys have no clue what the VIP Discord is, it's pretty much like a Patreon, but all the benefits and everything happens on the Discord. So you get to watch all my YouTube videos before anyone else. And there's also exclusive contents like a gold making lists and spreadsheets and investments and a bunch more of cool stuff. So if you want to check that out, that's going to be linked down below together with the zero to 10 million gold guide. With that being said, though, that is pretty much it. So thank you guys so much for watching and I will see you all back in at tomorrow's video. But until then, bye bye.